Hey everybody, Scott. Here's a new feature in ScreenFlow 3.0. Let me show you. Have you ever brought in a watermark or something and when you try to position it, you can't get it just right and you know you end up bringing this image someplace and it ends up really not where you want it. Well, what you can do is that it's real easy to now change the position of your tracks. And if I come down here, you're going to see the little handle here and I can move my tracks around. And if I wanted to drag it up one more, I can do that. And that's where I would want a watermark anyway. So this makes it really convenient to move my tracks just by dragging and dropping now. Now, the other thing you can do is that if you come up here, you can change the height of that track. So if I wanted to make my tracks smaller, I click the down arrow just like that. Now I can get more tracks on my timeline and that's awesome. And then what uh, you can do is that you can change how you prefer this in your preferences. So come up to ScreenFlow Preferences in the timeline, select your defat, defat, default track height. So there you have it, a really new way to, to work with the timeline in ScreenFlow 3.0. Hey, if you want to learn more ScreenFlow tips, take a look at my site, and I hope you got a lot out of this quick little tip. Take care. Bye.